People really haven't found a great service to just answer that question. What is that? Tell me about that house. Tell me about that mountain. Tell me about how simple it is. It's easy and fast. They just simply point at something. There's nothing more complex about it. Like they're holding a TV remote in their hand. It's that simple. It's just like using a remote control for your TV. You don't need to use complicated maps or lists or anything like that. You just look at that object, you point at it, press a button and get information about it. The possibilities with it are endless. It's really going to be a game changer. It seems simple. Get information on your smartphone just by pointing. No typing on small screens. No fumbling with web interfaces. No sifting through thousands of possible answers. Just point and get the information you need. It is that simple with the iPointer ID engine. The iPointer is all about simplicity, making it easy for people to, to learn about and interact with their surroundings. You don't have to zoom in, you don't have to touch, you don't have to rotate, you don't have to click the mouse all over the screen to interact with this map, you don't have to hold the, hold the phone up and you're looking at the screen and, and there's bubbles popping up of icons of what might be in that direction, you can't see them, they might be miles away, and you're tying a double tap on it, and the sun shining, and glare, and really all you do is you just take your cell phone out Point at something and you get what you want to learn about. The iPointer ID engine combines the GPS on your phone with the compass on your phone to answer a simple question. What is that? The iPointer is kind of the, the reverse of a search engine. Instead of typing a word into a search engine like uh, the word apple or the word orange and getting, yes, it's searching 4 billion websites, but it's still giving you 10,000 results and you still have to filter yourself, filter through these 10,000 results. Is this the page I want? Is this going to provide me the information I want? The eye pointer is the opposite. You start with one object and then from there you get relevant information about that one object. So you start with a building or a house. The application we're developing is called Realty Pointer. With the eye pointer, what that really allows is you get information on any property in the United States immediately. Value to the real estate professional is that they get the results and the details that they need instantaneously without having to find out an address, go back to their office, um, look it up in the MLS, or you know do more research to find out more about that property. But they'll be able to get it right where they're at. And with the Realty Pointer, what we're able to do is, if somebody does have an interest in that particular home, um, they don't have to get out of their car, they don't have to go scan a code or text a, a number to the agent. They can literally point at the object, go, okay, this is the home I'm interested in, and they can actually press call agent, and it will call up that agent right then and there and let them know, I'm sitting in front of this house right now, I'm interested. There are so many different applications. There's tourism applications. You, you're walking through Las Vegas, you point at a resort, and you get Samantha Brown from the Travel Channel describing it. We're actually working on one right now called Campus Point, and the way that works is uh, at any university or college that you'll be able to walk up, point a particular building, and have it come back with class schedules, uh, the professors that are teaching the classes. There's asset tracking and management, helping FedEx and UPS. They're identifying the building before they put the, the box there. They're making sure that it's the right one at the right time. Imagine an application out there where you could, could literally point at any mountain or a portion of a mountain and it can tell you trails, information about who first climbed it. I know about Applebee's, but I want to point at it anyway to find out if there's anything new. Uh, do they have any coupons? I'm interested in dinner and I'm interested in probably eating some steak. Are there any steak restaurants that are, that are willing to offer me a deal? iPointer, I'm excited about that because I think once more and more developers and entrepreneurs in the world start discovering what it can do and there's a lot of creative minds in this world and with uh, iPads and droids and iPhones now it, it being able to return information even faster um, it's exciting to know uh, or even at this point not know what somebody has that this is going to spur a great idea for a great application that can use this technology.